Real Country 1430 AM and 107.3 FM WRDN. I'm Brian Winnikins. Joining us this morning, Ashley DeMuth, and she's the CEO of the Menominee Area Chamber of Commerce. And uh, today we're going to talk a little bit about some of the things going on with the chamber. And uh, Ashley, thank you for joining us today. Well, you're moving. What a brand new office. Tell us about that. We're moving. Um, yeah, so we actually are going to be relocating um, after, gosh, I think it's been more, more than 20 years in our current location. Um, we sold our building in April. Uh, during the, the start of the pandemic, it seems like so long ago, but so short time ago. Um, we are going to be relocating, though, to um, 1125 North Broadway Street. So we're making the move to North Menominee um, to a new location. And we're just really excited to trailblaze into 2021. So how long is the move going to take? When will the new office be open? So we we're starting our move um, just before the first of the year. Um, the chamber is going to be closed January 4th through the 8th for the relocation. Um, but don't worry, our chamber staff is still going to be available for you by phone and by email, um, just not for walk-ins. Um, and then January 11th, we'll go ahead and open back up and be available for stop-ins and visits. Talking with uh, Ashley DeMuth, she's CEO of the Menominee Area Chamber of Commerce. Is the office bigger smaller tell us a little bit about the new office what is it going to provide some new uh, benefits for members it sure will so um we have not first off we when you walk in the door you'll be greeted of course by our wonderful receptionist Lori. she does such a great job um being that that fresh smiling face for walk-ins and visitors um we have an expanded visitor area so uh, you know we are a chamber and visitor center so uh, we like to welcome in locals as well as uh, you know external from the community uh, visitors and we'll have new merchandise and just a great display area. We'll also have some promos going on our television out there, learning about the Menominee area. Um, of course, offices for staff. And then um, in our suite, we also have a, a technology appropriate uh, conference center. So as a chamber member, you can reserve our conference center anytime um, that we're open as well as some after hours by arrangement and, and you can utilize that and we'll have technology hookups with webcams and a TV and, and um, conference phone and different things too so we can go kind of into that new age of making sure that all of the meetings can happen. Um, we also will have a drop in workspace for individuals or if you're meeting with two or three people we have a smaller workspace that you can also reserve so you know if you're a real estate agent or, or if you are someone who's working remotely and you need constant internet access, that's all included in your chamber membership. So use those spaces because they are of value. Talking with Ashley DeMuth, she's CEO of the Menominee Area Chamber of Commerce. Ashley, was was there a certain, did, did the building need to meet certain specifications for you? And that's why you decided the location where you did? Yeah, I mean, we, everyone always has a laundry list when you're looking for a new place, right? Um, parking was one of our, our number one uh, requests. We, you know, being on Main Street, it's a great location. However, parking can be really challenging, especially for larger meetings and on-site programs and activities. So the new location really boasts a great parking lot. Um, and it is so large. It is so large that we can host different programs and activities out there um, right on site. And then we also do have a little bit of green space behind the building that we can host some different networking and, and leadership Menominee activities and different things too. So um, parking was definitely high on our list. And also just really that member benefit of having member use space as well as a, a prime visitor center location. This gets us a little bit closer to 94. Um, so when we have visitors, although they tend to come downtown, we really want to catch them and make sure that they know about all the great things that happen here in Menominee. Talking with Ashley DeMuth, she's a CEO of the Menominee Area Chamber of Commerce this morning. Ashley, it is the holidays and a year and all of that. And uh, the Menominee Chamber going to be doing some little bit of a holiday get together, I guess you could call it, uh, with the members. Tell us about that. We are. So um, historically, our holiday party um, in December is one of the more sought out uh, networking and business connection events. And unfortunately, due to COVID-19, we did have to pivot uh, that event. So um, we are going to be hosting, it's actually going to be this next Monday on December 14th from six until 7.15 PM. We are doing a virtual happy hour uh, for that holiday party. And we're giving away over $500 worth of prizes and gift certificates to local businesses being able to steward our local community. And we're going to have some fun activities to uh, get you involved. And uh, we're doing that all through Zoom so that can be accessed anywhere that you can get online. And uh, do uh, uh, the uh, business owners and the members, do they have to register in advance? How, how will they go about? 
Yeah, if you visit our website, also if you subscribe to our newsletter, there is a registration link. We are asking you to register in advance. Um, this is free for members. So if you work for a business that's a chamber member, you can come. Um, so a really great opportunity for that. Um, but yes, please do register. It's quick, it's easy, it's fast. And then we send you reminder emails along with a Zoom link right before the event. That's, that's a good idea to send the reminder emails because yeah, uh, you, you, a lot of people will totally forget. I, I get that. Now for 2021, we're so hoping that um, things will get, quote, back to normal. But what are some of the things the uh, Chamber's planning here, at least initially for 2021? Yeah, you know, we there are so many unknowns for 2021. Um, we're really trying to be as cognizant to the needs of our community and the health and safety as possible, but also with the understanding that the show goes on. So we're making the show go on in ways that we can. Um, so you are going to see some virtual programming that is going to be taking place throughout the winter into the spring. Um, we do anticipate still having the annual banquet. It will look different than it has in the past. Um, another question that we really get um, February is coming up and we always think of the Chippewa Valley Rally. The Day of Advocacy, we, we usually bring a group of people down alongside the Eau Claire Chamber and the Chippewa Falls Chamber. Um, we, you know, the Chippewa Valley Alliance, we take people down to Madison, they talk to their local legislators about pressing issues and this is a budget year. So it's really important to us. So we are looking at coordinating that event to also look different um, in a safe fashion with those um, collaborating chambers and, and stay tuned for more information on that. But um, we will still be having business after hours in different in different ways, um, leadership menominee. We had to put a pause on that this year, but that will kick off in September of 2021 again. So um, we're, we're just trying to focus on what businesses need most. And you know, throughout the pandemic, we have been working with businesses, I would say most on helping them stay alive connecting them to funding, connecting them to resources and different things. And, and we're really hoping to be able to continue doing that into 2021 to make sure that our businesses are, are thriving. That is uh, Ashley DeMuth. She's uh, the CEO of the Menominee Area Chamber of Commerce. You're listening to Real Country 1430 AM and 107.3 FM WRDN.